everyone, welcome to Cruising with Kim and Jen. And today we're going to be looking at Voyager of the Seas, a moderate sized ship from Royal Caribbean. It's an older ship and it is beautiful. You can see here it has all of the flair of a, of a very nice, beautiful ship. We were lucky enough to get a junior suite. We were on deck nine, room 9614. And as you can see the layout, we have walk-in closets with lots of room, a full bathroom, which was really nice with a full tub. And then we had a seating area and a huge balcony to go out on. Now they can make your beds into queens or twins. And moving outside, they have the rock walls and flow rider and an observation deck was, was really nice that you could sit up there and look at your ports or just look outside and still have a drink sitting there. Now these are some pictures from the casino we had a casino pool met lots of new friends there now if casino is not your thing you can go to a show they have shows at night that are fantastic this was a a chicago rendition and and it didn't disappoint at all you know we really enjoyed this we also attended a game show it's it's if you know it dance it so they play music and then you can dance out and so that was a lot of entertainment now you can either you know, participate, or you can just hang out and watch. Either way, it's a great fun. Now, following that, you can always go to the Royal Promenade. The Royal Promenade has entertainment nightly there. There are bands or activities. Of course, the Promenade has different types of shopping as well as, as you can get Sorrento's Pizza. You have Cafe Promenade all included in your cruise fare. They have ice cream there as well. Now the promenade is smaller than the mega ships, but it's still a lot of fun. This is out on the deck, on the cruise deck in the afternoon. You can see that it's not you know, horribly busy because the ship is large enough to accommodate where they have many things to do during the days. Now, this is one of our favorite places to go. This is the main dining room. You can see the main dining room is absolutely beautiful and the food is fantastic with Royal Caribbean. It is beautiful. They have linens and it's just kind of like the older you know, ship flair, which is fantastic. Now, this is an ice skating show. Now, Voyager of the Seas has ice skating where you can ice skate in the afternoon as well as they have a couple different layouts of shows in the evening and they were really fun. One more of a upscale show and then one that was a, more of a family fun show as this one was right here. Lots of interaction and lots of fun. Now, if you don't like ice skating, you can always go to one of the parades. They have parades on the inside in the afternoon with floats and that's a lot of family fun as well as adult fun where you can go and hang out they interact with you as you go the promenade is just a really nice place to go and hang out they do show movies up on the deck in the evening as well now voyager of the seas goes to many different ports this one happened to go to san juan st thomas st martin st lucia and st kitts so it's very port intensive as my friend kim says and we have videos on each one of these ports and what we did on them and some hacks that I think you will want to see. So please like and subscribe and join us for all of our excursions and we hope to see you soon. Thank you for watching and we'll see you soon on the Lido.